second this is lesson 15 of hands-on equations and today you're going to learn that negative x is the same as your star negative x is the same as your star so if I write the equation 2x plus negative x plus 3 equals 2 negative x's plus 15. It's the same as writing 2x's plus star plus 3 equals 2 star plus 15. So again, negative x equals the same thing as the star, the asterisk that we use for the star. And we know that because we know that the asterisk or the star is the opposite. It does not equal the x. It's the opposite of. So that leaves us with this. Negative x is also the opposite of x. And that's the only difference. So let's do an equation. Let's actually solve that equation. We have two x's plus a negative x, which is still our white pawn, plus three equals two negative x's plus 15. So what, what's the first thing we can do to solve this equation? Truman. Take a uh, two, two, I mean, you take one white pawn from one side? Absolutely. I can take a white pawn away from each side. What's the next thing I can do, Lynn, to help me solve this equation? Uh, you can add a picture. Well, no. You can subtract the what? The three. So I can subtract the 3 from the 15. So if I take 3 away from this side, that would get, leave me with 12 on this side. What is the last step I need to take here, Tyler? What do I want to get rid of? The white pawn. Absolutely. How do I do that? You add a white and a blue pawn. To the opposite side. So there we go. I added a zero. Now I can take a white pawn away. That leaves me with three x's equals 12. What does one x equal, Chris? Four. X equals four. Absolutely. Let's do another example. Now I have two x's minus a negative x. Do I have a negative x to take away, Truman? No. No, I have to create one. How do I create it? By putting a, a zero. Up. By putting a zero. So two x's minus a negative x. I just put my zero up there. Now I can take my negative x away. Plus four equals two negative x's plus an x. What's the first thing I can do here, Chris? Take an x away. Okay, I can take an x away from each side. What's the next thing I need to do? What do I need to get rid of here? Vanessa? Two, two I do. I have to get rid of these two x's so that my cube can stand alone. So where do I add those two zeros? To the white pawn side. side. So there's one taken away. Add another zero. There's another one taken away. That leaves me with four negative x's or four stars equals four what does one star or one negative x equal? One. It equals one. Let's do another example. I have two negative x's plus a negative x equals 10 plus a negative x. This is an easy one. Tyler, what do I need to do first? Take away a white pawn, a negative x, or a star from each side. That leaves me with two negative x's 
equals 10, or two stars equals 10. What does one star equal? Five. five. Absolutely. Star or negative x equals five. What would x equal? Negative five. It equals the opposite. Last example is three negative x's minus a negative x, which I already have, so I can certainly take it away, plus five equals eight plus a negative x. Truman, what's the first thing I can do here? You can take two, uh, actually one white pawn from both sides. Absolutely, I can take one negative x or one star, one white pawn, they're all the same, away from each side. What's the next thing I need to get rid of? Chris. Okay, where do I want to add the pair? Left side. Okay, so what do I get rid of now? The white pawn. Now what can I do? So I have the five here, I have the eight here. If I take five away from here, I have nothing. So I really needed to, let, let's start this one from the beginning. Because you wanted to take the 5 away, that leaves nothing on that side. So, let's set that up another way. Well, the same way, but let's look at it a different way. We have 3 negative x's minus a negative x plus 5 equals 8 plus negative x. So, what did we say the first thing to do was, Truman? Take a uh, white pawn from both sides. Take a white pawn from both sides, then what do I need to do? I have five here, I have eight here. What can I do now, Chris? Eight, seven, five. First I can take five away from this side, then I have to take five away three. from this side, that's going to equal three. So star, or negative x, equals three. Excellent job, thank you.